We've got till dawn to find the source of this power outage. Let's get digging! Excuse me, Strawberry. Mm. Can you read this, please? I don't know if the most practical game for a nighttime campout is pick up sticks. <laughs> I thought it said trail mix. <laughs> I got the trail mix and the cereal, celery, soda crackers, wheat crackers, the crackers with pepper sprinkles, the cherry likes, firewood, playing cards, sunscreen, extra socks, bandages, sandwiches, hand sanitizer, trail mix. Oh, wait, I said trail mix. Mm. Um, apples, two dozen. Orange, this is just an overnight camp out. They'll have the power fixed by morning and we can move back into town. <laughs> Meanwhile, time to head for the peace and quiet been fun. Listen, I have an idea. Remember how much fun we had on our relay race and treasure hunt? Let's make the creepy woods into a challenge. We have three tents. Let's break into three groups and see which group is brave enough to camp out the longest. Ooh, I dare. I'm in. Me too. I love an adventure. Lemon, you and I can share a tent. We'll be team one. Tent Lemonberry. Plum? Team two rocks. We'll be tent berry, plummy, and orangey. <laughs> <laughs> Raspberry, cherry, we're team three. Tent very tough. <laughs> <laughs> All right. This is gonna be so very fun. We'll show them what team three is made of. <laughs> well, okay. It's on. That should do it, Tom Tom. Thanks for helping. Well, let's get back on the road. Mm -hmm. What is it, boy? <laughs> you smell something? Oh, I know what you smell. <laughs> We're not far from Berry Bitty City. How about stopping by and visiting our friends there? I have a book I can return to Blueberry. Hope it's not too late to pop by. Mud pies. How'd we end up at this dead end? I must have turned the wrong way. It's so dark out here. I don't get it. I could see Berry Bitty City right in front of us. Then all of a sudden, I couldn't see it anymore. Hmm. Well, there's something over there. Oh, here's a trail. Let's see where it leads. Come on, Tom Tom. <laughs> hmm? <laughs> What's wrong, boy? You're not afraid of the dark, are you? It'll be an adventure. I've got snacks. <laughs> I think it will be fabulous fun to sleep under the stars. We don't need the tent unless... Unless what? You know, if uh, there might be, or like, if there might, if any kind of, well, if a sort of creepy kind of creature happened to be around. 
Now, we can't think like that or we'll never win the challenge. We're gonna be the bravest of the brave, are we not? Uh, sure, but some distraction would be nice. How about we sing a campfire song? It might hear us. It? Maybe we should turn out the light so it doesn't see us. Hey, what happened to that light? <clears throat> Don't worry, boy. We'll just follow this path. Ah, uh, this is the life. It is. <gasps> Want to roast marshmallows? Okay, sure. Anything to take my mind off. Whatever might be out there. In the Help me find some sticks for the marshmallows. Huh. Hmm. Okay. Here's a good one. What did you say? Oh, strawberry. I'm certain I just saw a creepy creature pass by a minute ago. Are you certain? Uh, sort of certain. A creepy creature. Well, what did it look like? Well, I didn't really see it, I guess. Could it have been something else? Like, maybe still a creature, but not a creepy one? For example, could it have been a bunny rabbit? Oh! Yes, I suppose it could have been a creature that is not creepy. Perhaps. Well then, let's get roasting! See? <laughs> Where did the marshmallows go? Hmm. Pupcake! Hannah! <laughs> did you take the marshmallows? <laughs> they didn't take them. Hmm. Hmm. Weird. Yeah. Weird! <laughs> Running out of juice. <laughs> But that's okay. More adventure in the dark. Snack time. Yay! Good one, Orange. I'm having a very good time. I'm actually not scared at all. Me neither. <laughs> mm. Oops. <laughs> I'll get it. Hey, where's Marmalade? Marmalade! <laughs> there you are. No wandering off, please. Where are you? Down here. Where to go? I don't know. It's like it just got swallowed up. Swallowed up? You know, disappeared. Swallowed up by what? Oh, I, I didn't mean it that way. But you said it. Y you must have had a reason, a, a feeling. No, it's just a way of saying went missing, you know. I didn't mean I really thought something actually, you know, ate our horseshoe. I mean, who would eat a horseshoe anyway? Hmm. A creepy creature, that's who. How do you know creepy creatures don't love horseshoes? <laughs> that's so silly. I know. <laughs> did, did, did you hear that? Sounds like something eating a horseshoe. Mm. <laughs> Those are good. Where is Blue Bandit? I think she's to the right of her flag. Maybe one of us should go back and guard our flag. That's not, I mean, is that really fair? Because there's only one of her and two of us. She didn't say we couldn't split up. Okay, but I don't want to be alone. <laughs> okay, don't worry. Uh-huh. Hey, Blue Bandit is making a move for our flag. Let's get hers. <laughs> go, go. <laughs> we captured your, your flag. flag. I captured oh. your flag. Ah! It's a tie! I win!
was sure one of you was gonna ambush me over there on your side. <laughs> that was so fun. Let's do a tiebreaker. Definitely. Hot chocolate break first. Yum! Great idea. <laughs> Excuse me, Chiffon. Hot chocolate time. To bravery! To the wild outdoors! Woo! <sighs> well, ready for another game? Yup! Sure. Where are the flags? Guys, guys, calm down! I've gobbled our horseshoe! We gotta get out! Stole our flag! Right under our noses! It's too spooky out here! Someone or something is trying to sabotage our camp out! Well, let's calm down and just review the facts. Fact! Our horseshoes got uh -huh. eaten! Eaten? Well, they definitely disappeared. Our capture the flag flags disappeared also! Mm -hmm. And our marshmallows and roasting sticks did go missing too. Except this one! Oh, just let that creepy creature try and take this one. <laughs> That's the spirit, Lemon. We may have a thief among us, but why should we let that spoil our camp out? Let's make it part of the challenge. Hmm. Staying out here with a creepy creature thief is challenge enough. I'm thinking instead of which team can stay out here the longest, which team can catch the culprit? Hmm. Mm -hmm. How do you catch a creepy creature horseshoe eater? Well, I guess it's up to your team. Hmm. <gasps> I've got it! <gasps> I know how to catch it! Shh! Lemon, what do you see? You're right, Strawberry! No one is gonna stop me from having a roasted marshmallow. <laughs> You're right, Lemon. Let's capture that marshmallow thief. She's gonna creep past this. <gasps> oh, Marmalade! How did you get out of here? You're supposed to stay in the tent. What was that? Come on, we'll find out. I can't sleep. Me neither. I'm too excited. I hope we catch the creepy creature. I'm thirsty. Want some water? I'm having a hot chocolate craving. Oh, why are we whispering? <laughs> Blueberry, cherry, and raspberry have hot chocolate. They do? Three whole thermoses of it. I'm gonna go get some. <laughs> Careful not to get caught in our creature trap. <laughs> Wouldn't that be embarrassing? Getting caught in our own trap. <laughs> What is it? I forgot to give the other teams their thermoses of hot chocolate. I'm gonna go take it to them. That's nice of you. Want me to come with you? Well, who's gonna stay here with me? You have the puppies and a whole moat to guard you. It's okay, Cherry. I'll take Scouty. Come on, Scouty. Come on, boy. Walk. Go for a walk. Um, um. Drawbridge, milady. Why, thank you. Don't mind if I do. You can do it, Scouty! Hmm. Let's check that out. Oh, 
Ah, mud pies. I don't hear the whistling anymore. Now which way do we go? Ah, let's get out of here. Let's take a walk and look around. Listen Hello there, to Cherry. The pretty sounds. Cherry. No, Strawberry. Don't come any. Closer. Did we? Did you? Is there? Oh my! What did we catch? Strawberry. Wish we'd thought of this. Easier than digging a moat. It's the creepy creature. Girls! You! We thought you were the creepy creature. <laughs> you don't really think we're gonna catch something, do you? I brought you hot chocolate. <laughs> <gasps> they caught him! The creepy creature! Come on, Hannah! Careful. <laughs> Lemon! Careful of the string. Did you catch it? Maybe that's it. Did you Where catch is it? it? We didn't catch anything but ourselves. <laughs> you got caught in your own trap? Yeah. What happened to you, Strawberry? I got caught in their moat. Huh. I feel shortchanged. We haven't caught anything at all. <gasps> help! Help! Help me! Oh, great galloping gooseberries! <gasps> if I didn't know better, I'd say that sounded like... Huckleberry! What are you doing in our creature trap? Not much. What are you doing here? I was delivering pups for adoption, and I thought I'd stop by and say hi, and then the lights all went out and, well, <laughs> I got lost. <laughs> <laughs> We're having some juice power problems in Berry Bitty City. How about setting me free? I don't know. Have you been stealing our marshmallows? And our horseshoes? And our capture the flag flags? Huh? <laughs> okay, so here's my plan. We all pretend to go to sleep, and we leave Lemon Stick. And when the culprit steals it, we'll hear the bells and... <laughs> Mystery solved! This is so exciting! I don't know if I can pretend to be asleep. I'm so excited! <laughs> People, people, remember our acting lessons. Just relax your faces. <laughs> Where? Oh, hey, girls, wake up! The stick! The stick! My marshmallow stick! Wait, listen! What do you think it is? My, I hope it's not a creature that's too... creepy. Hurry! It's getting away! It's heading for home! Marmalade? You are the creepy creature? <laughs> Marmalade! What in the very bitty world are you doing? Did you hear that sound? This is the source of our power problem. My tennis balls! Our flags! Our horseshoes! The marshmallows! Marmalade, you silly puppy. So this is where you...
you've been putting everything. <laughs> it was the fountain clog that bungled up the juice berry power grid. Problem solved. our camp out. Of course not. We haven't roasted marshmallows yet. <laughs> uh, special delivery for Barrick and Bruce. He's on a break. We'll take it. <laughs> oh, great. Thanks. Oh, oh please, please <laughs> Wow! It's from Barry Big City Motor Parts. Oh, bouncing berries! This is what the boss has been waiting for. The new hydraulic juicer rinser for Cherry Jam's tour bus. Oh, let's reach my car! Well, let's get to work. We'll have Cherry Jam on our way home before you can say... Goodbye. Like nuts. Raspberry, watch out! Oh. Oh. <laughs> you lost again! Oh. You've lost three games in a row. We've heard of being a good sport, but this is extreme. Raspberry, is there something else you might be so giggly about? Okay, okay. I'm sorry, just... Okay, so last night, right after the talent show, something very unbelievable, well, incredible, well, um, and uh, just great happened. Excuse me, Miss Raspberry Tort. Here's my car, darling. Give me a call when this hoopla dies down. I'd like to talk to you about your absolutely fabulous fashions. Wow! <gasps> yep. <laughs> Here's your card. Raspberry, that's great! <gasps> yes! Wow. Yeah. What'd she say when you called her? Uh, well, uh, I haven't called her. What? <gasps> Why not? Because I'm so scared, excited, nervous. I because what if it's if it's not? What if she says who? Raspberry, the dog trainer. Oh, dress designer. Ah, yes, it's all coming back to me now. The glitter gown. Well, darling, are you sitting down? Because congratulations, we're hiring you to make six thousand. And addresses for the annual Berry Big City Firefly Convention. <laughs> I mean, who needs that? You don't know that's what would happen. And you won't know till you call. Yeah, well, maybe later. I can wait. Well, we can't. But our, our game. <laughs> <laughs> the game can wait. She might make you a fashion star. Think of the fame! The fortune! The fans! Oh, uh, hello? Yes, this is Raspberry Tort, and I... You have? 
Really? Oh, you do? Me? <gasps> yes! Uh, well, I guess... Yes! <gasps> well, tell us! What? Oh, she... Uh, they want me to come to Berry Big City immediate... Right away, and talk about... Yes? Yes? Starting a new line of raspberry glitter. You know, glitter gowns. <laughs> You have to help me. Tell me what to wear and what do I say and how do I act and... Oh, very big city. You don't need any help from me, Raspberry. Just be yourself. Come on, we've got to get you packed! Oh, come yeah! on, Raspberry! <laughs> Wonderful! Now let's... Uh, Miss Jam? Oh, hello, Berrykin Bruce. Came to give my apologies. I'm afraid your part still hasn't arrived. Part? Uh, what part? Uh, the hydraulic juicer rinser for your tour bus? Oh, oh, yeah, of course. No problem. Oh, well, thank you for being so understanding, Miss Jam. I know how anxious you must be to get back home to Berry Big City and get your tour underway. Tour? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Ah, uh, don't worry. I'm in no hurry. Oh, don't worry. I'm in no hurry. She's so nice. I'll get to the bottom of this. Yes, hello? Very Big City Motor Parts? I'd like to speak with the manager, please. Oh, uh, 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 Strawberry, uh, which one's dressy enough for Very Big City? Uh... We should ask Cherry. She'd know. Oh, uh, that's okay. Don't want to bother her. Hmm. What's wrong? Strawberry, do you think Cherry doesn't want me to go? Did she say that to you? No, but she doesn't seem so excited for me. I just don't know. You're right. You don't know. And you won't know until you ask her. Yeah. Okay, pretty pink or very merry magenta? Uh... <laughs> Both! Better to be prepared. Good luck! Oh, wow, Raspberry! Have fun! I made you some hair scents for the trip. Good luck, Raspberry. Oh, thank you, Lemon. Did you talk to Cherry? Uh, I will, yep. Good. Good luck. Have a great time, Raspberry. Oh, thanks, Cherry. I just, um, I, I wanted to ask you, do you know which hair scent you think's best for Berry Big City? You're the fashion expert. <laughs> Goodbye, everybody. We'll see you in a few days. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, muffin crumbs. Nice <laughs> shot, Blueberry. Plum's turn. Fumble and poison berries. I ripped my dress. <laughs> 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 Raspberry will sew that up in... Oh, that's right. She's not here. Ah! <laughs> it's an email from Raspberry. Listen to this. I can't believe what's happening. They're giving me my own design studio? <gasps> my own staff? <gasps> I'm coming back tomorrow to pack up the boutique. They want me to move here. <gasps> move there? <laughs> uh, wow, <laughs> I didn't think she'd be moving away. Well, it's probably just for a while. I know. Let's bake some treats for a surprise celebration for her. You mean a send-off? Strawberry's right. Let's not show her how much we'll miss her, just how happy we are for her. Let's get started. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah! 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 
fashion star of very big city the fabulous raspberry she eats up the fashion scene oh dear I think we got off on the wrong stop uh, no uh, this is it <laughs> my home sweet home you mean your old home girls girls look it's Mavis Maraschino from the fashion further forward show she's doing a segment on me and my fashions oh wonderful raspberry love that show. What a... welcome to Berry Bitty City Mavis that's Miss Maraschino to you dearie oh I'm sorry I thought you'd remember me from that time you interviewed me I'm cherry jam <gasps> Blad Scarlet Cummerbunds! Oh, Cherry, what have they done to you? Honey, I can get you a limousine straight to Salon de Vol. <laughs> no, no, no. I'm just taking a little vacation here with my friends. And... They're holding you prisoner, aren't they? Oh, did they take your clothes? My lawyer can... Miss Maraschino. Mavis, doll. Mavis, please. Mavis, I'm quite happy here, and I am choosing to be here. Oh, well, you just say the word, and my people are at your service. In fact, I've been dying to get you on my show. Now, where's my little protege? To your best hotel! Oh, excuse me, girls. Gotta go! <laughs> Bye. Um, what was that? If you find out, don't tell me. I don't think I want to know. Pinched, pleated Paisley, you poor dear. However did you survive in such primitive working conditions? Do yourself a favor, my cashmere kitten. Leave it all behind, especially that. But... But this is my very first sewing machine. It's always been with me. A dinosaur, my soon-to-be superstar. Let it go. Fashion forward means forward, not backwards. Mavis feels need for major manicure. There wouldn't be such a thing as a beauty salon in this outpost, would there? Why, yes, there would. We'll be right over for an appointment. Now, shoo, shoo, shoo. Ra, 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 raspberry is on a busy schedule. Raspberry, we're having a little party at the cafe tonight. Oh, uh, I mean, ra, ra, okay, yeah, uh, I'll be there. Oh, no, 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 Miss Meringue. That's so last century. Oh, oh no. Oh, no, dear. You're thinking too small. Raspberry is not just a designer of fashions. She's a monument to fashions. Uh, no, 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 no. She's a winter, not an autumn. I want her studio painted winterberry rose, not fall mauve. They want to speak to you, dear. Hello? Uh, sure. <laughs> Whatever she said. <laughs> Don't mouse your nails. From head to foot, everything about her has to... Roar. Every shape, every color must roar fashion. Wait. Ooh. And what do you call this? Blackberry seed facial mask. We wanted blackberry seed and guava. I am out of guava. No, no guava? guava? Very big city salons are never without it. And never without the snootiest stylists. Oh, but Cherry, dear, they're the most famous, most highly sought after. Maybe that's why they never make friends with you, like Lemon does. This will never do. Don't worry, dear. Mavis is here. We'll have it all redone when you get home to Berry Big City. Strawberry. Cherry keeps saying what she doesn't like about Berry Big City. Now, you listen to Mavis. That's just what stars do. She's afraid of competition, so she's trying to convince you not to go. You mean, she's jealous of me? Uh, Raspberry, maybe you should ask Cherry? This is a bittersweet goodbye. Tears and smiles at the same time We know you gotta go and live your dream We've been together 
She needs her beauty sleep. She forgot us? The raspberry I know would never accept an invitation and not show up. <laughs> and I miss the raspberry I know. Cherry, is there any reason you wouldn't be happy for raspberry? Yes, there is. I mean, we're all going to miss her, but this is her chance to be a star. When you're a star, Sometimes it's hard to be yourself. Raspberry isn't acting like herself, and the raspberry we knew was happier. So you're not jealous of Raspberry? Oh, no! I'm worried for her. You know, the stars shine much brighter here than in Berry Big City. Oh, not this cafe again. However did you survive with just one restaurant? Oh, uh, I, uh, I guess Strawberry's just such an incredibly inventive cook. We just never got bored. What's going on? Excuse me. Uh, hiya, Raspberry. Hi, uh, do you know where Strawberry is? Oh, Rice. <laughs> That's where we're going. I can't believe they didn't remind me. Come on, Mavis. I can't miss it. It's my very favorite event. Boats? Oh, wait. If it's boats you want, I'll sign you up at the very big city yacht club. <laughs> Glad you're here. Hi, Cherry. Why aren't you racing? It didn't feel right taking your boat out without you. Oh, I wasn't sure if you wanted me here. After last night's party, we weren't sure if you wanted to come. The party! Oh, oh I... Oh, no! Oh, don't worry yourself, kitten. Who wants to go to a dismal hoedown anyway? Well, I would. Oh, it's so not you, Button. Actually, it was a surprise going away party for you. Really? Jump in. Can we be a team? Sure. Hey, come on, Mavis. We can catch up. 
Bitter button hooks. You're not serious. Us in that? <laughs> She's my champion boat. Come on, get in. It'll be so fun. I am not getting in that bucket. This is not you. Mavis, watch out. <laughs> <laughs> Look at me! <laughs> Mavis, I think that look is you. <laughs> How could you do this to Mavis, Maraschino? I have nothing prepared for my next show. <laughs> It was kind of you to lend Mavis your tour bus, Cherry. It was kind of you to throw her this going away party. Oh, it's not a going away party for Mavis. It's a staying home party for both of you. Are you sure you want to give up everything in Berry Big City? Nothing there can make me feel like a star the way my very best friends do. The way you do, Cherry. I'm sorry I thought you were jealous of me. I wasn't being kind, wasn't being me. I'm glad the real me is back. Welcome home. Strawberry shortcake? What are you up to today? I'm creating ways to make flowers different sizes. Both very big and very small. Even if you don't have a whole lot of room, you can still have plenty of flowers in bloom. <laughs> That's a very clever idea. Strawberry? It certainly is a fine morning to enjoy the flowers. Oh, well, I'm not just enjoying them. I'm going to make a new perfume with pieces of the petals. Oh, nice. Yeah, nice. But it's going to be part of my new spring fashion line, my very best ever. So I want it to be really super special. Well, with all these flowers to choose from, you should have something really special in no time. Goodbye! Today. But Quilting Club is your favorite. Is something wrong? Yeah. This. I promised the princess I'd make waiters for all the berrykins for their annual jam stomping. 
dozens and dozens of them. And I thought it would be easy because the berrykins are so small. But it turns out making something so small is actually so hard. You see, to make them watertight, they need little itty bitty teensy weensy stitches. Too tiny for my sewing machine. And they're so hard to see. Oh dear. Oh, that's too bad. Poor Raspberry. Oh. Oh, dear. Oh, Raspberry. Oh. If only those bitty berrykins were the same size as us. At least then I could see what I'm doing. Oh. oh, oh. Only six dozen to go. Oh, no. I could make them in no time if they didn't have to be so... so... so little! Ah! Hey! You know, if the berrykins were bigger, not only would this job be easier, but bigger berrykins could stop that much more jam. What's up? Okay, okay, everybody. They're too big, but I have just a way to make them fit perfectly. Just hold still while I. Oh, nice. Uh, did I smell bad or something? Oh, no. Uh, patience. Ooh. Now try the waiters on. Ta-da! Wow. Wanna try some of that? Why? <laughs> well, sure. Here you go. Great! <laughs> <laughs> Must have done this. 
Somehow. So, that's what happened. I don't know why the perfume makes things grow. It just does. That doesn't make sense. Perfume doesn't make things grow. <gasps> Berry can bloom. What about him? He was working on a spray to make flowers bigger, right near where you were gathering petals for your perfume. And it was pretty windy. Strawberry! Strawberry! My special spray somehow got away. We think we figured out how. Somehow, your growth spray got into my perfume. And when I sprayed it on the berrykins... You sprayed it on the berrykins? Well, yes. I was having trouble making waders that were so small, so... But, Raspberry, did you think how you were going to make the berrykins small again? Well, I thought they might like being big. Uh... Hmm. Uh, Berry can bloom. You have another spray to make flowers smaller, right? I do indeed. For whatever size you need. So maybe if Raspberry makes more perfume and you mix it in with the other spray. But why does he need to mix it with my perfume? My spray doesn't work that way. It takes more time. So something about the perfume must have caused the change when it was mixed with Berry Can Bloom spray. Then it's up to you two. We need you to mix some special perfume. <laughs> I'm just about done here, Berry Can Bloom. Let's go! for you to see, but not for me. Oh, so it wasn't just your growth spray and my perfume, but the sparkles too? It's a good thing you're so small, or we'd never have figured that out. Sparkles I can make, but I don't know how many it will take. Another test. Oh, we did it! We did it! Bacon Bloom and I found a way to shrink the bearkins back to normal! That's terrific! Great news! We knew you could do it! Way to go, Raspberry! Yay, Raspberry! Lots of sparkles.
looking up at a fairy cat. Looking way up. How's it going, Raspberry? Well, we've been trying to make more. But Berry Can Bloom hasn't been able to match the right kinds of sparkles. Let's try again. This time, Blue goes first. Uh, you might want to sort of duck. Running. <gasps> if they can't run the berry works, then no one is making glimmer berry juice. What happens to Berry Bitty City when the juice runs out? Oh, this is absolutely awful. I thought making the berrykins bigger would be helpful. I didn't think I'd be affecting all of Berry Bitty City. Right now, we're the only ones small enough to run the berry works. You know, you're right. Just show me what to do. I helped cause this problem. Now I'm gonna help fix it. I'll help too. Me too. Me too. Let's go, girls. All right. Raspberry, we're going to need more of your perfume. Oh, uh, but the princess needs me to help run the berry works. And besides, I'm much too small to reach any of the flowers. That's not so. Even though we're bitty, we can do big things! Especially if some of the berrykins reach the flowers for you. Oh, I just thought of something. While we're running the berry works, who's gonna run our shops? Fruit salad, coming up as soon as I figure out how to make it. Hmm. Uh, 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 the tea on table five. Here's the waffle boards at table four. How do you make a waffle? Don't ask me. I've never cooked before. Neither am I. Not in Look at all of these. What do we do? Where are they supposed to go? I know. We'll sort them by color. He's right. Dips on green. What a great idea. So, what do we do? Whatever the barricans used to do. Come on. That way. I sure wish we could do it the way the Berrykins do it. They make it look so easy. But it's not. to change you just to make things easier for me. Oh, I ended up making things awful for all of Berry Bitty City. And now we'll mix another batch to change you and your friends back to normal.
ready to be normal sized again. Oh, Thank me. goodness! <laughs> You're glad things are back to normal. You know, I never wished the Berrykins were bigger, but I didn't really appreciate how important it is that everyone in Berry Bitty City is different from one another. Me too. Same here. Yep. So thanks to you and your potion, we actually found out what a big contribution the Berrykins make. No matter how small they are. And how much better they could run the Berry Works than we could. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone has their own special contribution to make, no matter how big or small. The Berrykins have theirs. <laughs> and we have ours. I know you've had a busy day, but we still have to stomp jam tomorrow. Oh, and I did promise you Berrykin-sized waiters. Hmm, maybe I can get Berrykin Bloom to make me small again so I can... How about if we just help you make more waiters? 